moving the standard pressure cell into the French press GM. Note, it is heavy, about 20 pounds or 9 kilograms. Support the bottom closure plug to prevent it from dropping out of the cell body. Lift and insert onto the ring on the bottom platen. Hook the piston's T-handle onto the J-hooks beneath the top platen. The top of the piston inserts into a recess hole in the top platen. Be careful not to bang your fingers or other items. Rotate so that the sample outlet tube faces the front in the direction of the collecting beaker. A run of flexible tubing can be added to direct the flow. The flow valve assembly should be to the left side and is clear to turn. Swing the safety clamp under the top shoulder of the cell body. Be sure the metal brackets are not touching the piston or it can scratch it. Be sure the small screw on the cell body is not underneath the safety clamp but in the back. Secure down by tightening the two thumb screws. Position the sample outlet tube and extension flexible tube to direct the output into the collection beaker that is sitting in the tray. As the lower platen moves, this tray will ride up to stay in position while collecting the sample.